So today I'm talking about a P0204 code, what it is and how you could go about fixing it. And so what is a P0204 code? Well, it's an ejector circuit open cylinder four. And so what does this mean? Well, basically each cylinder inside the engine is going to have a fuel injector that's sending fuel into that cylinder. But when you get a P0204 code, the computer's seeing some kind of problem with one of these, mainly on cylinder number four. If you were to get a P0201, that'd be cylinder number one, P0202, cylinder number two, and so on and so on. So the P0204 is pointing to that number four cylinder. So if you go Google your engine and like cylinder location or firing order or something like that, since there is differences and you locate cylinder number four, that's going to be the one to go and take a look at. And so what would be some possible causes of a P0204 code? Well, the main things that's going to cause this is either a bad fuel injector or the wiring going to the fuel injector. And so there's a few different ways to go about checking this and seeing what the problem is. If you have a multimeter, you can go and check that fuel injector and check to see if it's failed or if it's good or not. And basically these fuel injectors, they have a little coil inside of there. And when voltage goes to that coil, it's going to energize it, which is going to pull up on a small magnet, which then lets fuel go into the cylinder. So you can use a meter to test this coil part of it. Each one of these fuel injectors is going to have a rated ohms that it's supposed to be at. So you can go and look up what the rated ohms are supposed to be for that particular fuel injector since there is differences. And then you can use your meter and check to see if it's inside this range. If it's outside of it, then you know it's bad. If you can't find that information, you can check a good injector, one that you know is good. Check to see what the ohms are. And then check cylinder number four and see if it's inside of this range. But the first thing to go and do is test that fuel injector and be sure it's good. I made a full video on all this, how you can go and check the fuel injector and the wiring going to the injector. And I'll put a link in the description box below if you want to check that out. But the first thing to do is be sure that fuel injector on cylinder number four is good. If the fuel injector tests good, the next thing that could cause this is some kind of wiring issue. Like there's an open, a short, a bad connection, something like this. It's always a good idea to get a wiring diagram for a specific vehicle. Since there can be differences, that way you know for sure what's going on. But usually what's going on with these fuel injectors is that you're going to have two wires. You're going to have voltage going to it. So you're going to have like 12 volts going to it. And then the computer usually controls the ground side to complete the circuit. So you can't put the key to the on position. Go and check the wires. Be sure you've got voltage going to it. If you don't have voltage going to it, then you know you got to open in that wire. Be sure to check the fuses and things like this. And if you are getting voltage to it, there's some different ways to go about testing the ground side. You could check the wire and be sure that it's good, that there's no opens or short or anything like this. But there's also some troubleshooting techniques using a light because it'll pulse if it's working. Like I said, I made a full video on this. I'll put a link in the description below. But if that fuel injector test good, the next thing to go and check is going to be the wiring. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to give a basic overview of how you go about fixing a vehicle with the P0204 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you. Please click like, please click subscribe and have a good day.